All of a sudden, I just heard a gunshot that no one else seemed to notice. I had an excruciating headache. You know, I looked in the mirror and just like fell over. They took x-rays and stuff and they saw a little spot right here. The doctor told me it was probably nothing. Don't worry about it. Teens don't get cancer. Everyone asked me, oh, did you meet another person like Augustus Waters? I'm like, no. Gave me false expectations. Because I'd see us in the hospital. I'd see these commercials and I'm like, wow, this isn't what it is. In my hometown, it's bothersome how often this has been happening. This has to be like putting gasoline through your body. And then right as the first toxic drop went into my line, I became like Dwayne Johnson. Out here in the fields. You know, you talk to your friends and it's like, oh, we have boy problems, or I can't find a job, my classes are hard, and it's like, yeah, I have chemo this week, my hair is falling out. <laughs> it's not what I expected high school to be like. Um, did you ever meet anybody at your age? Not really. I'm like the only teenager in all of Montana who has this. To prove I'm right. On the very end, we have Hernan. Hernan is a cancer survivor. He's going to be documenting teen cancer stories in 50 states. Gentlemen, right here, please. Right here, Mario. Uh-huh. So yeah, I ended up in the hospital out here. A little drama and a road trip. You are on top of the wave right now. Yeah. And if you fall off, you're gonna get eaten by a shark. Yeah. So don't fall off. I won't fall off. <laughs> I wouldn't want to do it again, but there's a positive way to look at it. It doesn't have to be all tears. <laughs> Just one simple noun, six letters long, starting with C and ending with R, yet sounding so wrong. Stay.